So train tracks get it. I'm putting music to videos of trains, with audio tracks. I like to play the bass guitar, the guitar, six string, fretless, fretted. I just set up a synth guitar and millions of gear and loop pedals and the drums, the monica and singing. And I set up the whole spaceship and live stream for 10 years. And I have over 35 views. I know it's not good to flex, but I mean, come on. One day I'm gonna be a dozen air. Okay, let's start the video like this and we'll end it like this too. Okay, so here we go. I didn't have time to set up my microphone yet, but it is uh, March the 14th, 2024. And we're in Bull Repair Beaconsfield. Larry. So now we're going to try with these Hollyland wireless mics that I bought a few months ago. I'll explain what's going on here. Hello, how's it going? This is Jack here from A Bass Guy Show. And I'm currently located at Bow Repair train station. Down that way is where we're from in St. Anne's. And down there is Montreal heading east. And uh, today is March the 14th, 2024. And it's beautiful outside, the sun. So I'm testing out this clip-on microphone. I bought a whole wireless set, a really good one, a couple months ago, so that maybe later we could do interviews or do things like this. So I'm testing it out. And, well, I did a Bass Guy show for 10 years solid. We used to do 10 shows a week. And then we moved it down to three shows a week after a few years, and then one, and now none. <laughs> I did 10 years solid, and on my 10th, year uh, anniversary, it's episode 1,592, decided to take a break. There's things that I never talk about or no one knows. From doing the desk, I do my sound effects live and I, I, do all, I do all the sound and effects and foot pedals and lights and I'm always moving my arm and clicking things. My arm is absolutely screwed and in pain and after 10 years of damage, I cannot feel anything and that's in a lot of pain. I have spinal damage, that's why I have a cane. I can walk and I look fine, but not all disabilities are visible. I have spinal damage and it runs right from my eye down my back, down my leg, and it's a lot of pain and I don't talk about it much. Um, I've had no time to do anything. When I do live shows and make videos, there's zero time for even going to take a pee, you know, have a meal with someone, go see a movie or something. No time for anything. I've sacrificed my life to do a bass guy show and then I stop and then it just kind of goes quiet. So uh, I'm deciding to use this time to uh, invest in some new gear. I've got a DSLR camera. I used to have one a long time ago, 12 years ago when I lived in Scotland and I lived in Africa and Poland and Europe and stuff. And I always had a good camera with me and I got into photography as a musician. We might as well walk down here and test it, wait for a train. Uh, and then I didn't have one because of, you know, hashtag poverty. And I managed to get myself a second-hand camera. And now, over the last two months that I've been off the show, I bought a polarized lens, uh, sorry, f a fader filter. I got a lens, the camera, a really good shotgun microphone, these wireless microphones. I got two of them, tripod. Today I put a, ca uh, the, you're actually watching the, just my phone camera. I use a S9 Galaxy. I've had the same mobile phone camera for five years solid and I just keep using it because I don't believe in waste. Um, I spent two and a half weeks learning how to get Arca Swiss plates, slide on plates, so I can slide on my camera onto my bag. I bought a clip and e each of these little things is like 50 bucks, 80 bucks, 100 bucks and just adds and adds and adds and adds. And I don't buy it all at once. At the beginning of every month, I allow myself two little gifts. And uh, if they don't work, I return them. And so I'm working constantly on figuring out this video stuff and filming stuff. So now 
I'm able to film on my tripod and take photographs and I'm learning, relearning all my photography skills onto video now, learning how to shoot in manual. So, you know, shutter speed, aperture, ISO level, white balance. So we're testing out the microphone here and a lot of gear and you can watch some of my other videos. There's a link below to some of the stuff that I've been investing in. And what I've noticed is I've done 1,592 live shows and hundreds of other videos. And as soon as I stopped, everything just went boom, completely down. Um, all my albums are free. I have like 40 albums, they're all free. I have thousands of videos, they're all free. Everything is free. And uh, I don't monetize on YouTube. I don't make any money on YouTube. So like last month we made like 15 bucks or something like that. So if anyone thinks, oh, bass guy's doing this and that, whatever, it's bullshit. I'm literally, I'm gonna walk this way. <laughs> I'm literally paying to uh, entertain strangers for free. I enjoy, I wouldn't do it if I didn't enjoy it. I enjoy photography and filming and music. Oh, and talking about music, I invested in a, an old, from the year 2000, a Roland G, uh, T, whatever it's called, 33. It's a synthesizer, and I had to buy a pickup that goes on the guitar, and it wasn't working properly, and it cost way more than I could afford. And I'm spending all my money, and then ending up with no food or toilet paper money. But uh, I have I, the reason I'm doing this is because I, I need to uh, keep going. I, uh, I can't just stop playing music. It's amazing how many gigs you get when you have a disability or a different opinion. So there's links below if anybody wants to help. BassGuyShow.com, there's a whole bunch of ways to help there. You never have to, there's no pressure, but it's much appreciated. So we're gonna do the whole walk by the camera thing now. This is Rick Steves. Testing out this microphone, a clip-on microphone. I don't need to be 10 miles away, but we wanna test it. So behind me is St. Anne de Bellevue and we're at Beau Repair train station. It's taken me 10 years to set up my little homemade studio where I do live shows. I do it all in one take. I press record and there's music and songs and guests and Frankie McDonald. And we've gone through a lot of stuff, different characters and comedy and being serious. And I like to play funky jazz music. I play fretless bass and groove around and stuff. And I've decided after my spinal damage, my leg's bad, my back's bad. Um, instead of quitting music I'm going to keep on playing but I don't want to be trapped to form like I have to play pop songs or happy songs or play to drum beats you know even 4-4 four, four. I want to just make music so uh, I'm taking a break for the first time in four years but really not taking a break I'm working harder than I usually do on the show behind the scenes with gear and setting up and my apartment uh, is getting new electrics so we're all being moved out for two weeks at a time and then move back in and I'm having to take apart every single thing in my house, everything, move out and then move back in and set it all up. So it took 10 years to set up the studio, I'm gonna take it down and put it back together again. So hopefully I'll be back in October for my 50th birthday. I've already spent two months making one song, so I'm gonna move on to the next song. I won't have a studio to record in, so I'll have to figure that out as well. So I'm making an album, doing photography, studying photography and, and filming and doing these videos and shorts and doing the show and uh, the support just drops. So uh, I've been spending all of my money after food um, to fix the show and to get better at, it's not a show, you know, it's just me screwing around. Um, I did an interview too, I've got some surprises coming along the way and I'm working hard to the point where I wake up usually at four or five in the morning and I, I work from bed because I have spinal damage I have a heating pad and uh, I'm constantly MacGyvering tripods order things you order one little plate for your camera and it's like ninety three dollars and fifty cents that's just one little plate out of four hundred all the wires the synthesizer it's just and I make it work. I'm able to turn it on and make music and go live and have different cameras. If you check out my old videos from, uh, you know, from December 2023, check out that. There's some links below. And I'm, I'm doing all this live in one take and putting my whole life into filming and music and photography and I keep going. 
And because I don't, I'm not gigging for anyone, I'm not working for anyone, I'm not doing anything, I can do whatever I want, but it also means that there's like zero money coming in. It's like, I make about 40 or 50 bucks a month, and then I spend probably about two or 300 a month um, on improving the show, so. But it's good to get outside, it's good to walk. I have a very sore hip back here. Have you tried yoga? Hey, you should look up ableism. Try yoga or salads or whatever. I know a really good guy. That happens a lot, you know? And my pain is so fucking bad that by doing music and filming and photography and teaching myself like I did music, um, I'm ignoring the pain and I keep going. So if you like what I do, freaking, you know, go to BaseGuyShow.com and there's ways you can support there. And I always forget to ask for, for help. And thank you, I appreciate it. I want to say thank you to everyone who's ever watched my channel, the old bass gang, anyone who's ever come by. Shout out to John and Stefan in Slovakia, John in Florida, uh, Sky of the Universe, Alfred, anyone who keeps watching the show, thank you very much. I totally appreciate your support. If you'd like to help contribute, there's links down below. Hey, you want to keep the noise down? I'm trying to, anyway, Larry. So I'm trying to learn how to do digital SLR photography in manual mode while filming and sometimes filming in manual mode and doing the microphones and filming the trains and then there's portrait, there's like vertical and horizontal, uh, different formats and, it, and you know, it's hard to do everything at once. Like I was talking crap there before and I missed the beautiful shot of the train there, so. This is how I exercise my arm because it's broken. I gotta move it around. The uh, joint on the back is absolutely fucked beyond recognition. Keep doing music and photography and it keeps my mind off the pain. I don't get out much, these trips. So when I come out like this, it kicks uh, the life out of me. When I get home, I fall asleep straight away. I'm exhausted, I suffer from spinal damage. I, uh, I manage it, I got pain management routine. I wake up every day around five, try and get everything done before lunch. And I'll go for a walk or go out somewhere or I'll get a lift like to here. And uh, I'm always learning new things. Like I haven't had a, a real SLR camera in forever. And I used to like live with one and now I just got one again, so if you like my photography, there's links below. You can go to BaseGuyShow.com and you can click on uh, Travel or DSLR and I got travel photos and local photos. I'm always, see if I ruffle up the mic, I'm always putting up new photographs and uh, learning things, studying like crazy, film, music, chords, recording. So when you're trying to do a whole bunch of stuff, it's really difficult, like drums and bass, guitar and photography and filming and graphic arts. And you're not getting paid to do it, you know? I don't monetize on it. Um, I used the 50 bucks last month to pay for the $400 worth of gear kind of thing. I bought a gray card as well and uh, Arca Swiss slot plates so I can put the camera on my backpack or on the tripod and trying really hard here. I'm not trying too hard, I'm trying just hard enough. This is one life, you gotta live it. 
So we have a freight train coming in. Good to be back on track here. Thank you for watching not right. uh, my train tracks version of a Bass Guy show. Because usually I put on music that I made and I put it on videos and photography I did to trains. So train tracks, audio tracks. And it's so hot out today, it's like 15 degrees almost. You don't need a, well, when you get in the shade, uh, you need a, a jacket. So. The, as they say in Scotland, a jacket. So thanks for watching my videos. If you like them, cool. If you don't, you think I'm a weirdo and you're like, oh, that guy's a putz or whatever. Well, whatever, man. Cut. So thanks again for watching and the support. And uh, if you like my videos, great. And if you don't, well, I don't give a shit either. So uh, I'm going to do some crack. Cloudy now, so I think it's time to go after this train here. Do you want a photo? Some people in the train wanted their photo taken. I could hardly see them, but we took it anyway. settings. I'll get it eventually. Another 35 years and I'll figure out this whole music thing. So there you go. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, click over here on the speaker to subscribe to my channel. Click over here and you can uh, check out my website and maybe chip in. And down here is another cool video. Walk tall. And happy spring. <laughs>